Greetings and salutations YouTube, it's Hadrian here. How is everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. I'm here today with a thrifting video. Well, I'm like, what am I doing today? I'm like standing in front of the Goodwill. But I'm really excited to go inside to show you guys what's in there. If you guys would like to see more thrifting videos, hit the little eye right there, the window will pop out, and you can select the playlist for more thrifting videos, hot videos, handbag rehabs, and vlogs. And if you would like to have it done so already, don't forget to add me on social media. It's Hadrian, just like it's spelled here. And if you'd like to visit my shop to see what I have for sale, check it out, www.depop.com backslash it's Hadrian. But without further ado, let's go into the store and see what we can find. Oh, they got brand new tables for only $40, originally $60. These are from Target. There's this fossil bed for $30, bucks, so it's so expensive. What are these, Christine Price? Well, that is a really dirty coach, $10. Don't know about that, it's a little too banged up for me. Petco? Oh, that dog carrier, that's kind of cute. Let's see what bags they have here today. I feel like this store also in particular is getting like really savvy with their pricing, I feel like. Their pricing handbags more and more expensive. Here is a coach. I actually really like this print. I wonder how much it is, $8? I hate that they wrote it on the leather, that's kind of annoying, but I feel like I can clean it. There's no holes in it. This type of um, fabric is actually pretty easy to clean. Um, but I don't know. Should I get it and see if we can rehab it? I just really like this print. I love like the large stagecoach with the horse. I'm just going to hold on to it and think about it. Because it really is a cute bag. And it's not like the typical like CC fabric too. I don't know. I feel like these are more fun right i just love it okay i'm just gonna hold on to it for now think about it we're gonna look at the rest of these handbags and see if we can find anything else good it's like a fake brighton bag yeah it's bueno i love a good yellow bag tia neo So many pleather bags today. Oh, here's another coach. This one is ten dollars. Mm, it's really faded. Well, this actually can might be able to fix it. Let's take a look at the whole thing. There's a black stain on there. That might be removable. Some stains right there. The interior isn't too bad. We're gonna hold on to this and think about it also. Ready, so let's call the warehouse, please. See what we can find. Victoria's Secret. This cute looking bowler. I wish this wasn't put there. I actually really like that silhouette. Ooh, I love anything metallic. You guys know that. Let's see, what is this? No label. Okay guys, so I'm looking here at the wallets and I found this cute little coach wallet for 10 bucks. I'm just looking at it really carefully to see if I can clean it. I think I can, the inside is in really good condition, so this might be a definite yes. And then I found this really cool Christian Dior like makeup carrying kit. And at first I thought it was a gift with purchase, but then I looked inside the tag and this is $3. I looked here on the tag. And this is like, I think it's definitely a vintage piece, and it's made in USA. Christian Dior, made in USA. Okay, so now I'm looking just at the rest of these handbags. On the other side, right here, and I'm trying to see if there's anything else that's exciting and catching my eye. I kind of like that print, but 
what is it? 31. I like the shape of this. And look at you guys, I do have a shopping cart. You guys always ask me why I don't have a cart. I usually have one, but I usually like leave it like on the end where I'm not like covering anything so that people can still walk through. I don't want to be too in the way, but right now I have it with me. There's not too many people in the store. It's a little early still, and Hopefully I can find all of the cool thrift finds early today. Looking through the rest of these bags and I don't really see anything else. There is this Adrian Grail Gale bag. I don't know who that is. I'm gonna look it up and see. Check it out you guys. They have one of these cool like metal snakes. These are from Target, originally 25, here it's 15. <laughs> I hate snakes though, they're kind of scary, but if it was cheaper, I'd probably buy it. Look at these cool cats. These are really cute. So, oh, this candelabra is like amazing. It's really heavy. Looking at those faux botanicals over there and the pots. Is there anything cool? I'm always looking for good like vases and stuff. I don't know. It looked kind of cute from far away, but it's not my favorite design up close. Oh, look at the little pig. This is actually pretty interesting. I kind of like it. Seven dollars though. It's a little expensive. This is actually pretty cool. World Market, one ninety nine. Kind of like that. This is also quite interesting. Oh, this fake plant is actually pretty nice. $4.99 Market Bazaar. It's actually kind of nice. It's like it's pretty good quality, I think. This blue guy is pretty nice. Uh, this is like kind of cute actually. I wonder if there's no price. I wonder how much they'll give it to me for. If there's no cracks, I think I'm gonna get it. I'll look at it more in depth later, but that's pretty cool. They have a lot of jewelry boxes. That's kind of fun. What kind of stone is this? Oh no, it's not Pampered Chef. Ooh, this lion. Oh, it's a bell. Okay. This is like legit kind of cute. Oh, I think it's for toothbrushes and stuff. This is cute too. Made in China. Look at that duck with the flowers on it. You can find the craziest stuff at the Goodwill. It's so fun. This is kind of cool, but a little scary. Let's look at the other side here. Oh, this is kind of interesting. It has like a horn and then you can put candles on top. Look at this cool art piece. It's like abstract. Made in Mexico. Look at that fish. Oh, these all look like Pampered Chef. $2.99 each. I mean, they're cute. I think they're ornaments, but we can also use them to bake cookies or something. But... Oh no! <gasps> he is so cute. Better Homes and Gardens, $2.99. Oh, he is so adorable. Oh, he's chipped. Oh. oh, if he didn't have a chip, I would've gotten him. That's like one of my rules. If it's chipped, I can't get it. 
Man, it's really cute. That's pretty nice, actually. Look at all those pampered chef pieces. Haunted dolls. Edible arrangement. Ooh, look at that tiger. I mean, lion tiger. The Hamilton collection. Broken silence. Wolf. Ooh, look at that plate. What are these? Treasure boxes full of tiny, what are these? I have no clue what this is. Do you put like a plant in there? An air plant, perhaps? <laughs> this is interesting, but it's broken. Sassy lady statue. Look at these, they're like candle holders, I think. Are they? I think so. But they're like the jars. They have some good baskets today. That one's actually pretty nice. I just found like a casserole thing. I'm checking to see if it's Rachel Ray. And it is. And it has no price. I wonder how much it is. Oh, it's $8. I don't know. I think it's broken right there. Oh, no, it's not. I'll think about it. It's pretty good though. Rachel Ray makes pretty good stuff. I think that's a little expensive. All right, I'm looking at the cookware. See what they have. This giant purple thing is kind of cool. Snowman chef mugs. This is from William Sonoma. How cute. I wonder how much this whole thing is. Set of four months. These are like usually kind of collectible too. People collect these every year. And this one is a complete set. Sold. They have this pizza stand, but it's not Pampered Chef. Kind of like this bread basket. Made in Italy. A little expensive though. But it's really nice. I wonder if there's any chips on it. A pumpkin. Okay, it's $3.99 and it's William Sonoma. Oh my goodness, if there's no cracks, I'm not too sure. This one's a nice one, it's a really big size too. Checking out what else they have. What are those little guys? Those were like lettuce. Totally get it. Oh, this is so cute. Lemon meringue pie. That is adorable. <laughs> oh, this is a nice mixing bowl. $2.99. Oh, this is that cast iron thing that kept tricking me into thinking that it was like Le Creuset, but it's not. It's still here. Oh, these are from Pottery Bar, or Williams and I mean. Cute ice cream cone. Oh, $7.99 though, that's a little expensive. Hopefully it'll go on sale. Let's see what else they have here. Oh, is this from Pottery Barn? And it is Sausalito. Sold. All right, let's see what else they have down here. Ooh, I think these are for pancakes. And I broke the one that we had. Well, I didn't break it, but the lid broke. Pancakes. Doesn't have like any make or anything. The sticker, it's very similar to Pottery Barn. The little sticker mark, is that weird that I can kind of tell? I might get it if it's not broken, but it's six ninety nine. so it's a little expensive. that oh my god I found a hidden treasure did someone actually draw this it's beautiful it they did 
have a nice Christmas love always. <gasps> from 1982, vintage. It's from before I was born. Oh my gosh, I love it. It doesn't have a price, it's just sitting down here. Maybe it was in a frame and someone took the frame. Well, it's beautiful. Ooh, this is kind of nice. The finish is weird though. I feel like it like, has like one of those broken looking finishes, but that's how it's supposed to be. Oh, these are so pretty. I remember when they had these at Target. I already looked at that pillow, it's 10 bucks, but these are really fun. You can come in the pink. I wish they weren't $12.99. Now I'm looking through the knickknacks right here, trying to see if there's anything exciting. I don't really see anything too exciting over there in the middle section. This candle holder is pretty interesting though, I like the look of the wood on there. Uh, nothing else really though. They actually had another boat on one. And this one looks like it's used. The other one I think was new in box, but this one has coffee grinds inside of it. But other than that, it still looks like it's in pretty good condition. It just needs a good wash. And these are usually pretty pricey. Can't find a tag on this, so I'm gonna see how much they're gonna give it to me for. Found this skip and hop diaper thing. It's $4.99. It attaches to a stroller like on the car. I kind of like it, but I don't know. Should I get it? It's like a really good condition. It's a little dusty, but it's really clean. It's only $4.99 too, but I don't know. <laughs> These are the two most intense candle holders I've ever seen. This is so cool. Ooh, I kind of like this stool. Pretty nice. Okay guys, I just left the store and I got some really good stuff. So don't forget to subscribe so you'll be updated when I do post the haul video for this. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. It really helps a lot. And I love you guys immensely. See y'all tomorrow. Okay.